true desperation is known only when escape is impossible. So, we're starting the turns. So this is something that's unique to this game. It has turns. And as turns go by, bad, worse things happen. So it's kind of, and I've made a reference to Darkest Dungeon. I think only the four of us played it. I don't think you played it. But very similar. There, in that aspect, that things get worse as time goes on. Okay. So. Exactly what you want to do Unsheath your weapon, fellow party members. <laughs> we are going to the cellar. All right. Well, let me describe the the area here a little bit. Oh, um, yeah, because that was pretty much we went in the push open the front door and we could see the pool of blood. That's right. Right. And there, and this is a, like a two story place. So there is like two floors. And there is another, and there is like blood trail leading to the cellar, which is going down the sled of stairs. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, um, let's throw the spotlight around. So, uh, what does the cat do? Okay, well, she kind of turns towards the back with the light, just to make sure there's nobody coming in behind us. Okay. Right now, you don't have to worry about light, because it is getting dark, but uh, it's low light at the moment. No pincer attack. But you could certainly uh, light a torch or something if you wish to at this point, or light one of the lanterns that are on the on the walls. So there's no, there's, um, is there anything lit in the in the building at the moment? No. No. When uh, when uh, the last time we were here was it bustling or is it, or is... it was it was bustling. It was this is probably one of the busiest crossroads uh, in this area because not too far away is is like the it's like a, a river which is known to be a strategic point for or used to be once upon a time a strategic point where the elves and the dwarves uh, defended against the the darkness with the darkness one. Yeah. I'm um, Junebug's going to pull up my tinderbox and I'm going to light. Just imagining, you know, the band, the darkness. <laughs> <laughs> nice. um, Junebug's going to pull out uh, their tinderbox and uh, I want to light um, if there's any candles around or the lanterns sure. on the wall, kind of. Thing. Yeah, the lanterns are bedded to the wall. There's no candles or anything that's sitting around. Okay. But uh, they will light up. Okay. Uh, and they have enough. Drag a chair over yeah. each them, but yeah, sure. There's bar stools that are busted up and yeah. stuff, but you can. Get out oh, there. bust up! Does it look like there was a, a fight? Yeah, like like definitely. Is stuff furniture damaged? Yeah, and uh, the kegs are missing. You can see areas that are missing straight up where it was. <laughs> <I know. laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, there is disaster. Like for the most part, this place is ransacked. Shit. <laughs> yeah. And there's light in that area, so you yeah. don't have to worry about the yeah. light in that spot. I'll kind of go around the like sort of walls, like, starting by the wall by the door to light lanterns. And what do you two do? Uh, so I am actually going to explore the room. Um, okay. I'm doing a little bit of time wasting, hoping that these people will leave the room, but I'm searching, uh, for any specific signs that I might use to figure out what exactly happened here, whether this is uh, <clears throat> like the damage is done by weapons versus okay wild animals. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna make you roll something for that. Okay, just give you some insight of something like that. We're gonna need you roll your hunter. Okay. So it's oops. So it's uh your hunter. I'm gonna give you an ob of three. Okay. So, so what is your hunter skill? Zero. All right. So you got two choices. Okay. You can uh, beginner's luck and yeah. start learning hunter. Okay. Uh, or you can wing it, and uh, that would be foregoing beginner's luck and roll your nature instead. I think I'm gonna roll my nature. Okay. Is uh, what? What is your nature descriptors? Uh, I walk under the skies, I retreat, uh, and hide, and I what is struggle. This? Uh, are those the descriptors you mean? singing something, right? Should be, like, descriptors underneath your nature. Yeah, yeah. So I walk, retreat, and struggle. What? So okay. life of struggle is, is one of them, running. right? Versus the elves are ready to go to the That's west. Right. And then there's the walks under the skies versus... Yep. Yep. So uh, those are that those those descriptors are not part of what you're doing. So all that means is that when you roll, 
Yep. Uh, when you get your dice to roll, you automatically lower your nature by one. So okay. it'll be five of four. Sure. But you still get your five dice, though. Okay. But you just lower it. Why do you say four you, or yeah. five? Now, what? Why don't you say four or five? Four or five? Okay, sure. Four or five. Yeah, that's right. Because he doesn't know a fraction. Right? I don't, I don't know so. numbers. Yes, all. <laughs> so, yeah, it's four or that five. But, but you, you, get, uh, you get five dice. Sure. Um, uh, the only stipulation I need to let you know now, if you fail the roll, Oof. you get taxed based on how many, f- uh, by how, how much you didn't succeed by. So it's yep. an op three, so if you don't get at least three successes, yep. your nature gets taxed. Once your nature ever hits zero, yep. like, like you're taxed to zero, yep. uh, you have to replace one of your traits with a negative connotation of a trait. Because okay. uh, your nature is essentially how, well, how close you are to an elf sure. and acting as an elf. So... Uh, now, anybody else could probably help if, if you were looking for help, but if you're not looking for help, sure, April. Yeah, so like I said, I'm trying to waste time, so I'm staying away from these folks. Okay, sure. So roll your five dice and hope for the best. Hop three. <laughs> Four, five, and six is a success. Four, five, six, three. There you go. Nice. nice. Success. So, um, you, yep, yeah, just go down four or five and, su- and a success in uh, nature. So it should be, uh, I'm just getting a uh, yeah. there for you. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to. Let's take it up here for now. Perfect. Oh, sure. Yeah, they're perfect. So we're going to get it off the table. All right. Uh, so that's a turn. Yes, so exploring through, you, you realize you see little tiny, like, uh, like little feet all over the place, kind of like. Uh, of different creatures and, and animals. Now, at first you probably thought it was maybe mice or rats, but on further inspection, um, these, these could be nothing more, uh, nothing, none other than kobolds. So some kobolds came up from the, what looks to be the cellar and did a number around here and started looting the place. In fact, some of the areas are actually blown up. You can see that there are splinters of wood in certain areas. Explosives were used in that area. Is this one you used last time? <laughs> so I already know what's going to happen downstairs? Only a little bit. <laughs> you weren't that deep in it. As long as I don't end up accidentally adopting 20 kobolds this time. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <I don't laughs> my, my 5e D&D game. We, uh, I, uh, how many kobolds was it? There's a lot of baby kobolds who ended up adopting them. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Taking them like three weeks south to one of the other characters' uh, monastery they grew up in. Kobold, <laughs> kobolds are not, not all bad. Yeah. So. It was yeah. These are. Our, our deal was like, oh my god, guys. <laughs> Alright, so you, you retain that information. I'm not ready to be a parent yet. <laughs> when, when, you, when you say the blood leading down the center, how, how is, is that like, like this one? Like drips and stuff. And looks like there's, a like, drag. there's like a puddle somewhere in yeah. the door. Yeah. And then and then there's a drag down down the stairs. Is that the only blood? No, there would be uh, there will be a couple blood stain areas, but that one in particular was like a pool of congealed blood. Is there really no bodies? No bodies. No bodies. No bodies. Are there any? Is there like a back? Hmm? Yes, there's a back room. Yeah. It was downstairs. Because the blood needs to. Service. Yeah, sure. Yeah. And uh, I would believe the cellar, the entrance of cellar, would be in the back room or something. Right? Sure. Okay. Yeah, it's in the back in the kitchen. That's where that's where it was. It's in the kitchen, so it would be behind the bar. I guess I checked the kitchen. Okay. Well, well I would assume that uh, you you in in walking around you would have seen it. So, uh, yeah. So you see the the flight of stairs, like the cellar in the back, the the area looks to be very messed up. Looks like all the food's taken. Um, and any of the cutlery and stuff of that seems like a lot of that's taken too. And the spices. All the, the entire spices. Sp- the entire spice rack's gone. Anything left? Um, well, you're gonna have to find out about that. Let's do a scout op two. Aha. Uh-huh. So you're gonna be searching for some loots. How, how do I use beginners? How do, Why no, would they take how do I do beginners luck? You want to learn. Okay, you don't have to scout? Balls. No. <laughs> Alright, so if you're doing beginners luck, put an X in scout. Mm-hmm. And so Scout so is a want. <laughs> Scout is a health check. Yes. So <laughs> it's half of your health. Okay. Three. Yep. Three. Yep. And you need, what's your health? Six? Six. So you're going to need, uh, you need to test it six times. You don't have to use fails or passes, but you need to text, test Scout six times in order to learn it. And you'll learn it at an op three. 
Man, that is a lot. Yeah. It's because your health's so high. But it could be six fail, it could be six. That's right. Pass. Passes. Oh. That's right. Doesn't matter if it's fat, pass, or fail. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What is this? Five, five, three fives. Five, five, five. Wow. Okay. Uh, yep, scrimmaging through the uh, through the lot, you do find uh, an area that's like a a cold box, like uh, basically an ice box. Uh, and when you open up the ice box, there are two bottles of uh, their famed beer inside, like two contained. Mm-hmm. I guess. I Seriously, guess. he finds shinies. It's not shinies. It's not <laughs> yeah. I guess. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Put it in. Both of them together. Um, both of them together would be one D worth of boots. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Kind, of kind of shinies, kind of shinies, but drinkable shinies. <laughs> yes, they are rations too. One D boots. Yeah. That's right. And it, it, yes, and there's two of them. They can fit in one one pack, so that's fine. Yep. And slot. And slot. Yeah. 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 And I, since my back is full, I leave my hammer. In there. <laughs> 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 your warhammer, your your mace? No, it, it was a hammer. It was one oh. of those. Oh, it was an item that you could have. Okay, yeah. you just left the hammer. Here. <laughs> Put a hammer in an ice box. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the beer, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's your payment. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> while uh, while they're searching around, once I've got some like lanterns just in the main room lit, um, uh, I want to go over and check. You said some of the kegs were. Most kegs, most oh. kegs are gone. Most kegs are gone. Okay, so there's kegs left. Yes. So I want to check them out, and if, if I can, I want to pour the water out of my water skin and put like boobs in. Instead. Okay. All right. <laughs> uh, interesting you did that. Okay. So yeah, it, it fills, but you have a, a distinct scent coming from the booze. A distinct scent. Yeah. Fair enough. Um, bad or I, good? Yeah, I am. Definitely smells foul. Like smells smells sour or foul. I okay. drink it. <laughs> Um, yeah, because I am, I am, uh, cooking. I'm going to use the, I guess that's if I have to do a test, I'll use one of those. Just because I'm drink-wise, I was just wondering if. Mm. Are you drink-wise? Yeah. Well, that's okay, I'll just yeah. give it to you. Yeah. This, this, this keg is definitely gone bad. Okay, I want to check all the kegs then. Uh, they're all gone they're bad. They're all gone bad? Yeah. I sigh very sadly. There's areas that are, there are holes inside of the barrels, uh, so bacteria is definitely inside. Not well, tasty bacteria yeah. either. No. I sigh very sadly. They're smart kobolds. Mm. Uh, well, no, it looks like the holes were probably caused accidentally uh, through the, the scuffles. The scuffles uh, and stuff. Okay. Right? Damaged. Yeah. And explosives. And explosives. That's that. true. <laughs> yeah. There was bombs in here. <laughs> there were bombs. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fair so, yeah. yeah. I know. Sour beer. Oh. Bad sour beer. <laughs> hey, maybe, uh, maybe it's because we, we were all fresh. We actually do get one beer. Yes, you oh, only yeah. got one extra D. That's right. So you want to roll that up? No, I really passed. And, and you, are, you both passed, all right? Yeah. So that's okay. Yeah. All right. So. Okay, and then once once I've done that and had my, my, my terrible luck with it with not getting any good gear, um, I'm going to follow the blood trail into the the kitchen where I guess you are right now. Yes. Follow me. <laughs> all right. I'm kind of like looking out around outside. Just okay. make sure there's so, clues. and I'm uh, when I see you guys going, I'm like, "Did you go ahead? I, I just need to speak with my companion for a moment." What is it? Cobalt's just come into the room. He would. One, one, one. <laughs> I'm like squinting. <laughs> you two. Give me a moment, little one. <laughs> e- excuse me. <laughs> Do you know I'm level two almost? <laughs> Older than you <laughs> by a lot. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so uh, I check to make sure that you guys are not in view. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm in the kitchen. Um, I guess is the cellar door open or closed? It's open. It's open. Okay. You never said what's going on outside. If there's anything. Oh, oh yeah. Right. So the uh, <laughs> it's starting to rain um, and rain heavy. Okay. But there's definitely nothing else going on outside. Okay. Um, the area seems to be pretty quiet. Otherwise, okay. other than the rain. Okay. Yeah. Um, so there's nothing like going around the back or any kind of noises or anything like that. No, it's been dead quiet since you've been here, other than the pelting of rain. Now that you're starting to hear. Okay. So then I'll go in, I guess. Okay. And find her. Yes, okay. burden. Okay. So oh, she passes through. I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> 
like staying there very obvious and wanting to talk to my Oh dear. Alright, uh, and when you're gone in, uh, I just say, um, I just need you to stand guard for a moment, and I cast uh, Supernal Vision. Okay, so, so um, how long are you expecting to have that last for? Uh, not very long, just like long enough to look around the room um, and just walk into the next room, basically. Okay. Alright. Uh, so, um, that would be... I can see the map on the back there. Oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, so that's, so that's okay. going to be a straight-up op 3, um, Arcanist. Okay. And I get an extra Is four... Is it Arcanist or Arcanist? Arcanist, I guess. No, Arcanist. Arcanist. I've got my Arcanist, yeah. It's like, I've got my... It's probably one of those so you this is my... I've got three Arcanists, plus oh. I've got a... Yeah, fresh dice. Yeah. And did, uh, did you want to help somehow? Yeah. I'm not a magic fan. That's right. right. You know when he was talking about putting the hammer back in the box? Yeah. I was thinking about that's how the coop has got it. Um, <laughs> I do have I do have the supplies for this. Does that? Yep, get your extra dice if you spend the supply. So if for I every spend, this. yeah, so every supply that you that yeah. you use, you spend it. How would, gonna, you, how would you spend a blindfold? All right. It would just get it'll just it'll get, get magically sucked, sucked, sucked into the, the magic. Man. So it just basically you'll be like using like the blindfold. Like unravels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. That sucks yeah. into your eyes. No, no. <laughs> oh, gross. So you just erase it. That's all. Right. Sure, that's all. Six, six, six. Okay. Nice. So that's good. And you don't need to worry five, about... Five, uh, six, six, six. I know. So that's success. I'll be like, one, one, one. <laughs> so, uh, I need to get rid of mine. So, that <laughs> like, so that's only for one like turn, right? Yep. Like okay, so for the rest of this turn, until the next person rolls the dice, essentially, uh, you'll see if everything magical and such. Um, exactly. <laughs> As of right now, um, the only thing magical is something to do with your. You see, you may be able to see glimmits of magic from these two. Okay. Um, if you can see locations, it would be. That's right. So you yeah, would be able to see. My arm. That's right. My arm. You would see basically two rims of magic from from these two people, the ones that you're companions with. <laughs> okay. Uh, can I check to see if they're cursed? Um. So it's lore yeah, well, master to study the magical aura, basically. Yeah, and no, um... I, I just mean the magical items that they have. Oh, okay, to see if there's a curse. Is it, it's not an item. It's not no, a it's not. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, no, it's, it's, no, it's, it's no. tattoos. Oh. Yeah. Ah. They have tattoos okay. on them. Okay. Although you can't see mine. It's under my glove. No. Okay. Well, yes. And it's under yeah. my... Yeah. yeah. But yeah. You, you can see the outline of the tattoos, though. Um, right? And they're on them. They're right there. Yeah. Okay. They're, they're yeah. runic. Yeah, so so that's, your, that's, your, that's your spell for the... For the, First for the adventure. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Blowing June bugs. <laughs> it's terrifying. Yeah. So you burn that. She won't be able to use it. You won't be able to use it again until the next campaign. <laughs> but yeah, you can see that there's something wrong with th- those two. They have like tattoos on them that are magical for the most part. All right. I don't know if that helps at all, but that's, that's what you would see. Yeah. Well, maybe he'll like. I'm going around longer now because she's like, hmm, magic, where's that coming from? That's right, chop off their hand. <laughs> <laughs> they need that Sell hand. That. <laughs> Sell that. Sell that. Chop off their hand, maybe you get free from the curse. There you go. I still need my hand. <laughs> chop off his hand and take the ring. That's it. I'm no, like yeah. just taking the ring. <laughs> You're fine with that. Maybe we could trade hands. <laughs> <laughs> My character's a haggler. So. <laughs> Maybe we could trade <laughs> hands. <laughs> You're a cleric. You can, like, stitch the hands wow. back. Oh. <laughs> I'll stitch it with this hammer. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh. It's gone. This is where all the hammer gone. guns are. I'm right. a mace. I'm a mace. Oh, God. Mace, <laughs> mace, <laughs> surgery. Healing! <laughs> Where a hit first gets really hard because you got two things, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, if we're looking, um, you still got that lantern cap? I do. Yeah. Here you go. Light up the lantern. Light up the lantern. All right. Yes. Lantern's lit. And then uh, I'll kind of look around and be like, anyone else going first? I. Oh. Well, going first, for I am the leader. All right. You're not very subtle, though, are you? I do not understand the word of that. Yeah, you, have, you, you, uh, you come in, like, second with the light. I'll go in first. I have the light, don't I? Or did, yeah, you well, it's like, like, I mean, like, coming in at oh, the same time as you. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Not, like, taking the light from you. Yeah. <laughs> For whatever reason, I've now got my cloak up and, like, it's far down over my eyes. As I, I kind of, like, <laughs> like, I feel like it's 
take. <laughs> I do like a, a double take, like weird. <laughs> and then uh, I'm gonna all kinds, dude. All kinds. Yeah, yeah. Hey, just like keep that light just kind of near me, eh? and I'll go down into the cellar, trying to keep just kind of within the radius. Okay. okay. And you're going down too. Yep. All right. So cool. Uh, both of you make a health test. Okay. Uh, That's the only thing I passed last time. Let's see if it happens again. And your thing is supposed to wait, too. Your do, do I have to make a... Pass? Is it half? No, only those two. Because the moment that you're okay once you get there, and the moment that uh, uh, that is cat that steps on the stairs, oh. so they collapse. Oh. So. Half for all health. I should have remembered that. <laughs> it's your, your regular health test. It's your straight up four straight dice. Four. And, and I, gotta, I gotta get an ob first. I gotta give an ob. Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay. I don't want to see it. If you want to re-roll, you can. Please. I, will, I will take that because it was a terrible roll. <laughs> yeah, because I didn't uh, I didn't give you an ob, so technically I can't uh, okay. do anything to you. I forgot that. Uh, it's an ob two. So. Oh. Oh. Up two. Up I two don't get our fresh dice. That's right. The extra dice are fresh. Because uh, yeah. the condition, that would be the last time you use it. One, two, three, four. There you go. Oh, that's oh, hey, two. That's better. Two. Four, four. Five, four. four. Three. No. You get one extra dice. One extra. Oh, dice. Yeah. That means I get Yeah, that's what it matters. Though. Oh, there you go. Wait, I got four wait. now. What did you, what'd you say the health was? Two. Okay, yeah, I got two. It, right. I don't know what it is. Every time it's a freaking health test, it's like, right. oh! Okay. Nar- narrate how, you, how the stairs collapse and you don't get injured. And you fall to the um, bottom. Well, since, are, they, are they very long stairs? Yeah, they are they're, they're fairly lengthy, yeah. Uh, the stairs themselves, um, they wind a little bit. So okay. they actually do kind of wind. So a little bit of a curve. Yeah. Okay, so I'll say, I'm since I'm going down ahead of Cat, I'm kind of like... Pressing close to the wall, yep. so when I feel the, the stairs start to give way, yep. I kind of like I kind of catch myself on the wall and almost yep. kind of like jump slide kind of down, you know. Right. So I'm like kind of using the wall to keep myself wall upright. So then I land, might land like on, you know on my hands and knees or something, sure. but I don't, you know. I guess technically you could go back up the way you came. I, I said fall down, but you can narrate it either way. Fair. Well, I, I slow down. Okay. Yeah. And how about yourself? I've learned how to fall. So I just like fall, but without hurting myself. <laughs> slap and roll. <laughs> you just slap and roll. I've uh, come off enough horses to Does that. the lantern just go out though? Nope. I'm, I'm so awesome that even the lantern doesn't go out. You do like superhero lantern. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> and it's just like the flames like. <laughs> What is the two of us? I think. I don't know. <laughs> I just think so. So you, you see. Oh, I'm still at the top yeah. of the stairs. You're both at the top of the stairs. Oh. Uh, they probably don't. Uh, <laughs> oh, they don't have climbing gear? I thought you said they didn't make No, I said everybody else had climbing gear. Oh. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Okay. I don't know if they took climbing gear. Nope. I, have, uh, I have one kind of climbing gear. Oh, yeah? I have a grappling gear. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Well, that's no rope. Who needs a rope? Lucky for you, I have rope. Oh. Somebody have rope around their neck? That was you. Lucky rope. Yep. Yeah, around my neck. <laughs> that was around your neck. No, it's in my back. That might have been somebody else. But the grappling hook takes out two slots, so I assume it comes in rope. Um, yeah, yeah, I guess so. If it's just a hook, it's... That's right. Yeah, uh, well, it would be written in the in the actual book. So we'll just look up grappling hook. It's probably rope and hook. That's the case. They're supposed to be huge, too, so... Mm-hmm. Yeah, grapplings are bulky things. Yeah, yeah. there's the double side. Yeah. And yeah, they're not conveniently sized, um, you know. Shrink it down. Uh, yeah, <laughs> not, not exactly a... Uh... <laughs> we'll just see here now. Grappling hook. Uh... When used with rope. <laughs> so no, there's no rope. Okay. It is just no. <laughs> Someone's gonna have rope. I have grappling hook. Go never leave home without a rope. <laughs> All right. So just give you a so, description. You have the rope, and you're at the bottom. Two feels away from he's got the hook, and he's at the top. Yeah. No. So oh far, so good. You, you only get too many passes. You need fails now. I know. That's you gonna gonna be, like, two fails away you from could have, You could have like... used your things negatively in order to try to help yourself fail. But why do you Probably have... not. Well, because she, she's got, she's got, she uh, she's got like six uh, passes, but no failures on health. So she's... she's the only thing I've been positive at <laughs> any time. Um, damn it. <laughs> so, um... Uh, this this large low ceiling room is a chill. Uh, sorry, it's a chilly and uh, has a dank stank. Uh, 
man. Uh, it's filled with <laughs> tables, <laughs> chairs, and crates um, uh, for the uh, inn above. Much of it appears to be smashed and broken. Scorch marks all over the walls pulls the blood spot on the floor. So that's the description huh. of where you're, where you're to. Okay. But n- now, collapsed stairs. Yes. Right? And it's up quite a bit. Okay. Yeah. And just with an immediate glance about, can I see any other exits besides the yes. one you just fell down? Yes. There is an exit. Um, and, that, and actually, there's quite some. Is there, is, there are two doors leading um, ahead. And there's also a hole dug into the wall, and the the the, the, the hole itself looks like it's like fairly two, fresh. Two doors on the like ahead of us. Is that what you said? Yeah, there's two doors. Like look okay. like you know man-made structures, yeah. and then there's looks like just a big old hole in the part of the concrete foundation. Okay. I'm sure there's rope in this in this inn, right? How would, you, how would you guys want to get down? Uh, how 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 large is it? So I'm gonna start tossing. Well, I'm gonna start emptying and tossing kegs down and see if I can build a stack. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So for the most part, you're just gonna find the broken kegs and stuff, start chucking it down. Yeah. Make All it right. stink more. So you just hear crashes and. <laughs> What the shit are you doing? <laughs> I yell out. We'd no way to get down, my friend. Oh, my. I have a hook, but no rope. Just go out and go around. <laughs> well, you can't. It's raining. There's it's a the... hole in the thing you said. Yeah, there is, but that's in the basement. It's in where we are. So that's underground. Oh, yeah. Okay, it's yeah. also raining outside. Yeah. I don't want to get wet. <laughs> <laughs> Totally. Worship the god of dryness. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if, if all you need is rope, I've got rope. Possibly. That would be perfect if you were up here. <laughs> we can throw it up. Hey, Kat, you can throw a rope up, right? Uh, <laughs> you have amazing health. I'm just yes. wondering if I have something to... I have an idea. Hold it. All right. Toss your hook down. <gasps> Yeah. No, I'll just <laughs> grab it up. That's right. I'll like grab one of the boards, wrap the rope around, and throw it back up. Okay. There you go. Okay. okay. Sure. Uh, hold, don't throw grappling hooks at me. <laughs> so you, so you, just see, you just see like it, <laughs> <laughs> one, one of the items that <laughs> one, of, one, of, one of the chairs that you uh, that you threw down that smashed upon the ground has been thrown back up with rope attached to it. Yep. That chair is just a board or from well, one of the okay, casts. Fair enough. Or one of the boards. A chair link. Yeah. Yeah. A chair link, sure. Okay. I guess right. I try to shimmy it properly. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Okay, I just just grab it. Yeah. Go down. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So we'll get you to do uh, a dungeoneering oh, op two. Near them. No, the two that are climbing oh. down. Woo! I'm gonna, this is gonna be a beginner's luck. Beginner's luck. <laughs> luck. All right. So beginner's luck, or you can use your uh, uh, nature instead. Op. What's the op? Uh, the Opsonian op two. Okay. So. Do you uh, use beginner's luck again? What? Or you have dungeoneering here? No, I'm using beginners. Okay. Probably a health okay. roll. Yeah, it's a whole health roll, yeah. So it's three dice per Are we still fresh, health by the way? Roll? Yes. Okay. Come on. Okay. No. Nope. So you fall. Yes, I fail. Uh, no, you get another one, so it's five. No, no, no. This but is, this is two. This is extra. Uh, this is my extra. Oh, you okay. have right, extra dice. Why do I think it's uh, extra successes? Well, here Optimism. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so uh, you're doing game's luck. Yep. So what's your health? <laughs> Four. So it goes two dice. Yeah, yeah, plus one. Uh, plus one for your fresh. Plus That's right, yep. Wow, we. Nice. Oh my god, we can just like exploding. I, so I that's, promise these dice are not so, loaded. Yeah. <laughs> Normally they're just like, nope, no. Nope. So put an X in Dungeoneer. Okay. And then you can make it a pass or a fail. It doesn't really matter. But once you get four equal to your health there, you'll learn Dungeoneer. I failed. You failed? Yeah. He got one success. So you fall. To your death. Yeah. <laughs> Roll a new character. Uh, actually, uh, what's going to happen bad. is you do get down. Uh, uh, I, but, but, no the, but, but the rope, uh, as you're going down, the rope snaps. Fucker. And the majority of it's out of reach. And the what? The majority of the rope is out of reach once you, once you snap it. Ah. Well, you're buying me a new rope. 
So you do have a piece of rope, but it's damaged piece. A very, of rope. a very grumpy halfling informs <laughs> you when you get down here. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Shinies. Um, we need some shinies <laughs> for that and rope. <laughs> and on top you. of all that, wow, we. Oops, sorry. Um, the grind. So lose your fresh. Alas. The grind. Um, the grind. That's the fourth. That's the fourth turn. I'm gonna eat my ration. Sure. I'm gonna drink my water. I guess. Okay. Just give me back the card. Oh, I should. Uh, if you're not taking, if you're eating rations, but lose your, you lose your fresh. That's yeah. the main thing. Yeah. Now I'm gonna the the rope that came down. I give part of my ration to my mouse. My sure, rest. not a problem. Yeah. Squeak, the, squeak. The, the part of the rope that came down with him, I coil up and put back in my bag. Sure. By the way. So just damaged rope. Yeah. Just put an X or something or something that that indicates it's damaged. Or rope. Eat. Yep. Sure. And you keep your hungry. Yep. Okay. Yeah. As do I. Okay. At least we have a player. Plenty of days when I wasn't allowed to eat in the tower. That's right. Just another day. <laughs> Jesus, that sounds awful. <laughs> there, are, there are more days here, too, by the way. If you can. Okay. So, you're all down. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. So, you see two rooms. So, there are two rooms uh, that are nearby. Uh, is this through the doors? Yeah, so there's there's one door, and I'm going to see if I can give you like a description here. Oh, shit. I'm kind of weird because, oh, Sealy, I know more information than I should know. Yeah, but that might change. I wouldn't <laughs> worry about it. You say that, but you haven't so far. Nope. <laughs> but you don't remember, so that's fine. And you didn't get very far. No, I do remember. <laughs> This part. Okay, so there are two. It looks like to be one might be the actual cellar itself. Um, well, I guess that's where you're two. Yeah. But one looks like the, an area that might contain, maybe like the smells of it, might contain some uh, other types of, like the storage, like the coal storage. Okay. Uh, and the other area uh, looks to be sort of like. Uh, um, there's maybe, two maybe, there are there are two there are two doors. We're in the cellar. Right, you're in the cellar. There's two, there's two doors, and then there's a big hole in the wall. Okay. Uh, the other one the looks probably where would be where the booze may be stored too. So, so cold like, storage and and like a wine cellar area. Yeah, okay. Where does the blood trail? Be? The blood trail? Uh, well, you kind of lost track of that, uh, but. It's it's definitely. Uh, I'm gonna look around and see if I can I can find it. I'm gonna look Is the is the hole? Is it in the? I was picturing it in the floor of the cellar. Is it in the wall? Uh, the wall itself. Well, okay. That's yeah. Not, I was picturing the floor. I, I assume that's where the explosives. Okay. How we got it. Ish. But yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna look around. Um, are you going? See if I can pick up a. Uh, are you going to open a door? No. Okay. Um, I'm looking for the blood trail in the room we're in right now. Um, I'm gonna look around and see if I can I can pick up the blood trail again, and I'm gonna focus kind of on the area right by the uh, where the hole is. So I'm not gonna go into the hole. Sure. Okay. I'm going to open the. There's, there are two doors. One yeah. Is one, one looks like a wine cellar. Like you can see, like the I guess the makeup of it. Yeah, like it's slightly one? open. The other one's you feel like a cold that's coming. I'll from. open the cold storage. Cold storage. Because I had good 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 luck with the other cold <laughs> stuff, right? Yeah. All right. So uh, all right. Well, anyways, I'm gonna get you to roll your scouts. Uh, let's do an ob an ob three. Scout. Three. Are you is it? He's, are you talking to me or Gary? I'm talking to you. Yeah. Oh. Gary, Gary. <laughs> uh. Hey, cat. You want to give me a hand over here? I'm trying to find the the blood trap. So you got Pathfinder, right? Yes. So you can help uh, find some uh, yes. over by the entrance. You can probably help with the light. So that's a plus one there. Awesome. Anybody else want to throw a helping dice in? I, I, uh, I have nothing to help you. Because it's a oh, scout yeah. check and you need yeah. Pathfinder. Is there anything else that helps us? Uh, I think it's only Pathfinder. Pathfinder and I think Cartographer. Uh, no, I think Pathfinder is the only thing. I think Cartographer is for the side uh, use, I think. Yeah. Cartographer is more for. For like, back out, get back out, yeah, yeah, which is super important. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's right. So yeah, no, I think it's just it's just Pathfinder. Uh, yeah, it's okay. Yeah. So yeah, it's not, it's not, did I, what did I say up two? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Her. No, you said up three. Up three. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. Because I had I have two skills. <laughs> that's what All I was right. like really like I want. Uh, no, you can uh, spend a fate point or a persona to do stuff. Uh, I spend one for that D. Yeah, 
Yeah, actually, I'm gonna spend a persona point. Um, and add the dice. So I've got a few here. Yeah, so I come over with the lantern. Awesome. Thanks. Hey, three passes. There you go. That's successful scout. Nice. Wow, you guys are getting them all today. Yes. Uh, so yes, the blood trail Routine leads. <laughs> He's our good luck term. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. Uh, the blood trail is. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> yeah, Clearly so far. going in, so into that area the, with, the, with the with the wall, and you have a good track on it, so you probably will delete it from wherever it needs to go now. Okay. So. All right. Well, I found the trail again, everyone. Here. So you open the door to the cold storage area. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, the door seems to hang open in this room, revealing a cold stone room with wooden rafters uh, from which are on a multitude of hooks of aging meats and game. Now all empty. A powerful stench of urine and animal musk mm-hmm. pervades the room. Salted ham, gnawed bones lie near the door. Aside from a clear space where gorgeous and splinters show, something was dragged through this room. The floor is covered in rubbish and debris. Something was dragged through this room? Yep. Is there any openings or anything around? Uh, well, he can't see any deeper because nobody in the same with him. Yep. Oh, I light. can't even know. Oh, did you? Well, there's no nope. light, so. Yeah. I'll light my lantern. Sure. You want to go see you got a lantern as well? <laughs> yep. Okay. Oh, geez, well, I gotta keep track of two lanterns now. It's going that right. way anyways. Okay, that's okay. Then, uh... Right. The moment you light your lantern, you can see it pretty clear. There is a series of like rats, and they're gnawing upon bone. And the and the moment the light itches is the moment they like are they're like caught by surprise, and now they're like. Are they like giant rats? They're pretty large. Yeah, Uh, they would be dire size rats. (laughs) Rats. That's like the Australian. (laughs) Yeah. So you definitely stir them up, and they're squealing loudly. I smash. I run up. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Fair enough. All right, let me just take a quick gander here at, the, at these rats because I want to see if we're going to actually do a conflict with these or not. If not, I still want to <laughs> smash a rat. Yeah. 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 Okay. Good meat. It's nothing. Yeah, that's true. Any All rats? right. Let me get some dice. Oh. No, don't bring those out. Are they, are they <laughs> Maybe that's our problem is using those things. Yeah. <laughs> totally agree with that 100%. <laughs> All right, there's only three rats. So <laughs> many there. Um, so we can do it one of two ways. Um, we can do a versus test. Um, and that'll be like the whole battle. Or we can do a full on conflict if that's. If this is like something that would be a pinnacle uh <laughs> <laughs> I'll do it. All right, let's do it then. No, All right. What? <laughs> no problem. Uh, so we'll just do a quick uh, I guess we'll, we'll that way we can show Mike too Yeah, that's the, the, right. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's like, so that kind of works out. There he gets to fight three rats for his first fight. Nah. He gets to fight like four skeletons. <laughs> that's true. They were a bit worse. All right. So we'll go ahead and get the <laughs> Yeah. So, who's going to be involved in this? Anybody? Is everybody getting involved, or is nope. it just you two? Nope. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're over by the hole in the wall. All right. So let's uh, open up the books. We're going to need going this. Like, so, going on in there? I'm just screaming. <laughs> ah. oh, you're like, uh oh, what have I got myself into with this dude? Well, <laughs> I know exactly what he's like. I went to the mountain with him. That's true. That's true. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> okay. Do you think we should help? You you you, you, nah. you you hear like their mutters. Ah. How about we loot anything that they, they loot their corpses? I like how you think. Yeah. <laughs> anything, okay. really so while while they're fighting, we're gonna be scouring the room to see if there's anything like lootable, <laughs> like, okay. like worth of value in the, uh, the rubbish. We'll come right back to that. Actually, yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll do that at the, in, in between turns. Yeah, that's fine. Um, so all right. So the first thing we're gonna do here is what kind of what kind of thing do you want to do? So you can do a kill conflict, drive off, uh, capture, <laughs> or flee. When you say kill, 
<laughs> when you say kill, do you mean actually kill? If you do a kill conflict, if you die in Torchbearer, you die in real life. <laughs> right. So let me let me yeah right. Uh, let me let me put put it down to how they get written down here. Kill conflicts. When you're trying to slay your opponent, you put your life on one. Right I'll go with that. Yeah. All right. Yeah. You're going with kill. Dying rats aren't that tough. Okay. Kill cop. Well, you're not. You're, you guys are not that tough either. <laughs> I'm not like, talking about it. I can cast a spell that makes me see things. That's true. That's true. What am I talking about? That's one of my things All right. Can do too. Well, uh, let's let's see. So, who's going to be the leader for this conflict? <laughs> All right, sounds good. Let's do a disposition. I've got a dagger with no armor. Paladin. How 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 do you roll? No, he has yep. armor. He has light armor. No, so, Mike doesn't. Oh, uh, as long as Mike just pointed immediately at Jerry, like so. I'm there with a lantern and a dagger. What's your dude's name anyway? Hondopio. <laughs> non believers. <laughs> They are. They definitely the are not believers. Yeah, the rats are non believers. <laughs> all right. All right. So, rats and not rats. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> you are not rats. Uh, so, uh, what we're going to do first, we're going to uh, do your disposition. So, in your case, it is your. your whatever your health is, mm -hmm. which is what? Six? Yeah. Holy shit. Plus your fighter. So, roll your fighter. What's your fighter dice? Two. two, so roll two dice, and whatever successes add to uh, your disposition. So you don't have roll two dice? Yeah, two dice. Yeah. Yeah. You get the six from the health, right? Yeah, up. you get the six yeah. throughout the hall. Does yeah, that's what you're saying. Does or no? No, it's... Uh, oh, wait, and a minus one disposition because he's hungry, and he's part of the, the, the party. Well, I'm not hungry. Yeah, it doesn't matter. It's a group thing. Oh, dang it. Is it minus one disposition? No, no, it's, minus one, minus, one, it's yeah. minus one disposition altogether. Oh. So you still get the roll. So it's five plus whatever you got there, whatever successes. Uh, five. So one. one. So you're, you're back to six. Oh. Here's this vision is six. So divide that up among you two. So three hit points three, each, three. or you can do four and two. Yeah. <laughs> four, four, four and two. two. Four and two. All right. So we got uh, four for uh, Han or whatever. Yeah. I will stab and around. Two if for. The <laughs> if it gets close enough. Wait, wait, wait. Right. See how the combat is. Yeah, it's a lot different. Yeah, it's weird. All right. Oh, you're doing the cards now? Yeah, you're doing a conflict, yeah. Oh, wow. It's a very surprise. Oh, okay, they're coming. Oh, I forgot. You got a helping dice, too, from, from him, so roll another dice. Oh. Or, well, a dice that he would have normally given you, because it's a helping dice, but for thematic purposes. Roll, roll a dice. Yeah, well, yeah. either way. No worries. Okay, oh, so you don't get another one. That's fine. One, two, three, four. All right. That's it. Nice. Torches and swords. They make very nice dice. Yeah, right. That's really nice. Heavy, too. I like <laughs> All fails. Very pointy. So they have zero disposition? Uh, no, they have two. I love. Can we I've just. Got a full, I've got a uh, which can't give enough hit points. So only. So two of them must have ran away. One of them must have ran away. So that one of them is you killed one out of it. You killed them. You wrapped around the hop. You sneak attacked in. Came in, smashed them. I didn't sneak. You know. <laughs> well, you came in and smashed them. Well, they, they had diseases. That's awesome. All right. <laughs> I can't get rabies from skeletons. <laughs> All right. So now the, com the conflict works next. You thought you were better off. Uh, the conflict captain. In your words, what do you want to do here? I want to smash your head. All right, and they and they want you for food, so that's what their intent is. So let's see who gets their intent. You can have the last one. Yeah. Right, just using hit points, regrouping. Too many kobolds. No kobolds at all. So that's good. Uh, all right, choosing weapons. So what weapons are are you planning on using for this conflict? Mace and shoot. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, sure. Daggers, you're so. using a dagger. Cool. So just keep in mind what the, what, what the daggers do and what the weapons do, because it will come into play here. Okay. Uh, and these guys here are just going to be devouring, surviving, and swarming. Well, they're not doing much swarming, are they? <laughs> uh, okay. I'm being swarmed by two rats. <laughs> you're right. They're dire rats. Two dire rats. Okay. They are a little bigger. Yes. They're definitely bigger. All right, so here's what we're going to do. Oh. Uh, everybody get a set of cards. Really, I never really read, but uh -huh. the hand X, um, So I'm going to grab this set of cards. It's for mouse card because I don't want to buy... Okay. There's $15 no. for every set of cards. Oh, yeah, right, so I'm just going to use ones from previous games because it's the same rules. So here's your set of cards. Oh, good song for this one. 
Do we shuffle or? I uh, no, 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 no. We no. just that's just no. your cards. You get, to, you get to pick. Yeah, okay. Card. And there's your set there. Yeah. Okay. All right. Put this down here. I can't believe we're doing a conflict for this. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, what do you mean? You 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 said it. It's up. Jerry. You should you should expect this by now. Because <laughs> you also know what he's gonna want to do. <laughs> okay. It's Hondopio. So, it's it's Kingfisher winning fight. Oh, that's that. No, that's very true. Actually, Hondopio fights. Okay. So just 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 to give you kind of like an idea of like what to do here, I'm gonna put down three. I'm gonna put down three cards. Those are three full actions uh, of the conflict. There is I can't change once I'm done. However, uh, yeah, that's right. So if you look at these cards, uh, a maneuver allows you to kind of get an advantage for the next the next action. Okay. Okay. So it's kind of like it helps out. Whatever. Defend is recovering hit points, or you're you're basically well, it's not really recovering hit points, but what it is, you're you're recovering disposition. So you're basically saying, okay, we're not done yet. You know, we're gonna regroup and go at this. Uh, faint uh, is you're making an attack on them, uh, but uh, they can't defend it. So you're 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 making you're deking them out in a way that they can't stop you from 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 getting in there unless they're attacking you back, in which they get a free strike on you when you don't get to do anything to them. And attack is straight up like you're you are attacking the other person. Uh, and you're trying to get rid of the disposition, okay? So I means independent, so if it's attack versus attack, it's independent. Meaning both of you are gonna hit each other, you can double KO, right? Uh, attack against defense is a versus, meaning that whatever your dice rolls takes away from my dice rolls, and whoever has the highest sum wins, right? Uh, and then feint, same kind of thing, as you see there's a dash here for against that. And if you look at defense, it has a dash against feint. If you see one to three, that means you've got to have three successes if it's an independent to get one success. Mm -hmm. Okay? But if you're doing a versus, it's straight up whatever the versus is. I know that doesn't help a whole lot, but that's very much what it is. What might help out, though, is what each of them mean. Because um, you're probably going, well, what do I have to roll uh, for these? Uh, there is reader. Yeah, it has fighting something in it, yeah. <laughs> uh, no, but it sounded like a rat in there, like... <laughs> yeah, this is awesome. Uh, so, if you, are, if you are doing a kill conflict, you roll fighter for attack, health for defend, fighter for feint, and health for maneuver. So, if you don't have any... Uh, if you don't have any uh, fighter, uh, then you can use the alternatives of trying to use your health, because everybody got that. So, I'm going to put down my cards first, and then you can put down whatever card you want. <laughs> then we get to discuss who wants to go first. Yeah. Okay. And then we have to do an narration too of like like what they're doing every time, so Okay. And it goes first, second, third. And you guys can't act twice at the same same time. Like you, like Hayden both you you, you can't go my brother's dog you you and you it has to be Oh my god. So, do you want to go twice or do you want me to go twice? You're gonna go twice. Okay. I'll teach her. So, so be I'll be one in tree. Yep. Right. And you said you were going to the other room, right? Yeah, we're in the we're in the cellar room. We're just looking for The other room is barred shut. No, we're not going through anymore. Oh. We're in the cellar. Uh, yeah, we're just in the cellar, like, we can hear them fighting, we're just like, let's just look for loot. <laughs> oh, you're in, in the cellar? <laughs> yeah, look through all the debris but and stuff. What could sure. possibly be in this abandoned basement that's Pretty so Pretty much. Accurate. I mean, there's a little stuff beat up, you know, you never know, they might have missed something. That's you, cool. you already know that there... Or there might be something that <laughs> we can't see, or whatever. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> that's far I've started to accomplish my goal the blood, uh, blood, the blood went into the chest. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Character of yeah, we should look around the hole too. Questionable. <laughs> Not yeah. courageous. <laughs> Not courageous. True. I'm going Working. to tell you what I want to do. Sorry. I'm probably going to attack you. Probably do that with everybody though. Okay. So. I'm. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is we I'm going to take my them. lantern That's and sure. try to no. scare them. So I'm going to do a maneuver. Okay. 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 That works perfect. Uh, so just drop your cards down. I can't change it, so I already preset my cards. Yeah. Okay. okay. Perfect. seeing one of their rash friends just become squashed. They begin regrouping with the last remnants of the two and trying to uh, try wow, and, yeah. This rat. <laughs> yeah. So they're going to straight up try and defend putting, in, putting themselves in a better position to get back at you. Well, not really a better position but almost accordion themselves because they're scared from the light. Me smash. Me smash. 
Perfect. Hans, so, is, is your fighter yep. very surprised. versus Shocking. their nature? Uh, both of the rats are, are huddled up. If you want to get help, helping dice, you have to narrate how you're helping. Uh, okay, I'm I'm gonna sort of um, trying to stay away from them and get in a position to use the lantern, but I'm gonna kind of roll around and, and sort of pin them between us. Okay, give them a helping dice, and that dice will be if you help them. Um, does does this is the fighter pass and fail? Does, is that decided until the end or every roll? Pass or fail? What do you? Oh, this at the very end. It's not not for everything because because conflicts they roll a lot, yeah. right? Uh, now so hold on because I gotta one, check you something one here. One of the rolls that happened to you. And... That's right. So if he he succeeds, can he do like the Hulk smash thing? <laughs> oh, <laughs> the, the beat Loki up. <laughs> I'm not gonna, Stupid rat. I'm not gonna touch it. It's it's oh, oh, festive. You don't it's know it's that it's though. Right. I got to check this because they actually have stats too. Uh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Do you want Just cold or is that? No, hot? I prefer. I prefer One success. Temperature. Right. <laughs> you nail one of the rats. Yeah. You can narrate so you how you like nailed it. Oh, there you go. Um, so we hear him shining the light. Yeah. Because they're constantly scurrying around. Yep. I was like, Ugh, but I because thanks to his help, I can actually see. Yep. You can see him. Unfortunately, a maze could only hit one. Yep. One at a time. So I was like, all right. <laughs> Smash. Smash. As you go down to smash the other one, the rat attacks the light bearer. It's going to try to gnaw at your hands. It's trying to get the light out of your hands. All right. Maneuver. All right. So with their kill conflict attack, they have sharp incisors, giving them an additional dice. But because they really have one less, it just evens out. So it's only three dice. Okay. And maneuver is a health. Roll, it's health. Right? Yep. Okay. Four versus three. Can I help? You can if you can describe how you're helping with the, dif- uh, the maneuver. Maneuver? Yeah, so you have to describe what your maneuver is, too. Uh, so my my maneuver, like I said, is is primarily to try and and uh, scale them with the lantern. So, okay. it's not a- uh, so there is another rule in the game. If you repeat what you did last round, you get a not minus one dice. Okay. So you have to do a new maneuver, or 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 you'll lose a dice. Okay. Um, all right. I know it's really. You can, you, can, you can always like you can a maneuver can also be like you're kind of retreating. Yes. I definitely have maneuvered by hiding behind people. Or you can be like <laughs> swinging the lantern. You just gotta give a different narration spin on it. Sure, sure. It just sure. can't be the same thing over yep. and over. What about attack then? Uh, or yeah, well, swinging the lantern could be a way no, to. No, as in let's see if I'm attacking. Scrapping an attack. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you don't get in minus one for being like. If, let's well, say... well, you can always be. You just gotta put a different flair on it. So you're not going. I just attack. I just attack. You gotta be like I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm slamming it down and then I'm gonna swing across and try to knock the oh, other okay. one, or I'm gonna take a thing and I'm gonna huck it at it and just just do a different. Or I'm gonna throw my mace at it. Like just just do it. All right, I'm gonna take yeah. my dagger and I'm yeah. actually gonna flick some burning oil towards the rat. Ooh, Ooh. that's interesting. Ooh. Nice. Okay, that works. Uh, how, how do I help? <laughs> See, this is weird. To narr- That's why you can't always throw helping dice in. Because you got to add to the narration. Because I can't interfere because I will get scalded. <laughs> That's four dice. I'm really glad Han at you least can knows not to catch hot stoves. One, one, one success. You can kind of Two grab successes. them towards All right. the oh, He goes. So that is a uh, that is a minus one impeding on there because that's the only thing you can choose. Oh, so you uh, impede, you impede I was them both. Take a minus one. Nope, that's only no, four disposition. Disposition. Oh, okay. We've already, you already took the disposition. Minus. Okay. All right. So the next person gets well. He gets minus one. So describe how you hindered the the rat's uh, next action. All right. So the rat actually catches a little bit of oil on its uh, leg and uh, it, it has to kind of roll over and, and <laughs> yeah, and should put it out. I'm having like R O U S S. Absolutely. <laughs> Leonard Nimoy is coming into the room. <laughs> yeah. It yeah. it just goes wild. It starts attacking. It's like it's like it's burning and it's like it's writhing and it's just napping at the air wherever it can. Uh, Ooh, I ch- independent. <laughs> yep. I charge at it. Uh, this flaming. <laughs> it's not flaming. It's burning because it's got burning oil on it. Yeah. It's, it's not on fire. Uh, is it <laughs> but on it is fire? still flaming. Is it? All right. Yeah. yeah. It's still flaming. Okay. So it's got a bit of a uh, bit of burned fur going on. And then I just. You don't scare me. All right. I eat, I eat rats like you for breakfast. <laughs> you should choose a different diet to your choice. <laughs> well, 
<laughs> you should you should choose something else to eat. Rats are not very well, healthy. Are right. done? Maybe Can I help? Grab me. Uh, sure. Explain how you help. All right. So I throw my cloak over it and try to pin it. Okay. Uh, uh, and so that no, get it now. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. All right. There's an extra dice. You can get that dice cross. Thank you. I have a shield, so what is that? Oh, that's, that's for defense. Success. <laughs> Success. So. All right. It's so. Independent. Yep. It nips you, and you nip it. Uh, you hit it back. So you successfully kill the rats. Yeah. Uh, however, compromise time. Da, 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 da. Uh, hold on a second. Da, da, da. Can we record the health test from that? Injury. Uh, we will over that right we're, not, we're not completely done okay. yet. Yeah. Okay. But basically, when you finish combat, you pick one roll yeah, that you okay. made and you record that for the whole. It's like the thing that you earned from the combat. All members make an ob two health test, and this is recorded, by the way. Uh, not them, right? Just the people that were in the conflict. Mm -hmm. Health test. Oh. Health test ob two. Yeah. Oh god. <laughs> it's health test. Oh wow. Watch him fail. Right. Yep. Fail, Jerry. Fail. Fail. <laughs> I'm gonna. Uh, He's like the opposite. Do you have a six or anything? You no, got a six. You failed. I don't, but I'm gonna spend a. Um, spend a persona? Is that what? You can spend. I'm just gonna add a D with a persona point. Yeah. Right? You can only do that beforehand, though. Oh, Persona's okay. before Fate Tower. It's okay, you gotta fail. So write it down to fail on your health. Okay. So it's not that bad. And what'd you get? You got success, uh, obviously. Four successes. <laughs> yeah, okay. So write that success down. On My your jinx health. attempt didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> I think sure, he, he, could works, go, he could go exploding dices at that point. Oh, yeah, one six. There, yeah. yeah. Alright, so. Ah. Uh, fun. Oh. Alright, so we gotta do a compromise. So you pretty much only took one damage, so you're very low compromise, is what I get. Okay. Uh, so, uh, it seems like uh, you swung around, you, you, you hit it, you did your thing, um, and my compromise is. I don't wanna give you a condition. Let's see. Yeah, else. I gotta give you a condition in a second, but. Uh, let's see, what kind of compromise can I give you? Take a disease. No. That's probably pretty serious. Well, the, the, the disease. Yeah, the, disease. That, that, that was the other thing I had to roll afterwards. Mm. Uh, but uh, I got to. Because they nipped each other, so it'd be. They nipped each other. <laughs> yeah. Tetanus. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to think of a compromise, you know. Uh, something minor. Um, Flesh wound. What's the other one? Uh, yeah, I know. Sense. I know. Some of your one one <laughs> one part of your ration. Fell out of your package oh, no. and is now riddled in the maggots from the from the disgusting uh, mm. other meat that's on the floor. Extra protein. So just one part of them. So <laughs> out, out of three, it'll just be one part gone. Uh, and as for you, maggots are bonus protein. You pick that back up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's yeah, it's poison protein at this point. Uh, probably. Yeah. You get the sick condition. Honestly, I should probably go in there. And Why is it? I'm hungry and sick, man. It feels like I'm back home. <laughs> 